our chickens used to be right here. They free range. Maybe we've set a proper fire. They free ranged all through the yard, but their coops were here. Now it's fall and we moved the chicken coops into the fenced-in garden spot. We have a fenced-in garden spot because deer and other animals come in and eat the garden during the summer. But we are putting the chickens in and we brought these chickens in 24 hours ago. All right? You have to look at what they've done in 24 hours. This was all grass. It overgrown. This, <laughs> this dirt, this exposed dirt, They've done this in 24 hours. Now chickens dig, this is what chickens do. Right babes? I want y'all to see how much they have disturbed this in just 24 hours. That back there looked like this 24 hours ago. The plan is by spring when we move them back and have them in either another pen somewhere else or free range them. By spring, this, they're gonna do all the work for us and they're gonna get all the grass out. They'll also get most of the insects or anything that's in the ground, they're gonna get that. They're also gonna poop, which will fertilize the soil. Look at you, go girl, go. You're just eating everything. They're gonna poop, which is gonna fertilize the soil which will be good for it. They're going to scratch, which is going to aerate it. And I'm also going to put them in the soil with things like uh, mulch, leaves, old and aged sawdust, and things like that. And I'm hoping next year we're going to have the best garden we've had in a while. So happy gardening, happy chickening. <laughs> And I'll let y'all know how this experiment goes. I don't think it's so much of an experiment as what people used to do all the time. I haven't figured out anything new. Just letting them do their jobs. Right girls and boy? Y'all have a good day.